Snuggy finished brushing his teeth and rushed to the window. It's definitely daylight now. The moon is high in the sky and it is not yet light. Oh my! Why is it always dark? Quacky decides to ask Kiki, the smartest person in the world. Kiki! Kiki! Why is there day and night? Do you know? Kiki had read about day and night in a book and he decided to help Quacky with the answer. The spinning of the top will give you the answer. Quack! How is this possible? Let's do a little experiment. I'll play the role of the sun. Let's help Kiki dress up. Cardboard sun. Children's flashlight. Quacky will play the role of the earth. Help Quacky put on the earth puppet, earth puppet costume. In space, the earth is like a top, spinning all the time. Kids, help Quacky spin like a top. Look, Quacky is facing Kiki. Now I can see a big sun. Is it day or night at this time? It's daytime. Keep spinning. Now, Quacky's back is to Kiki. I can't see the sun. It's dark. Is it day or night at this time? It's night. That's right. In the universe, one side of the Earth is illuminated by the sun. The Earth is always rotating. When we spin to face the sun, it's daytime. When we spin to the other side, where the sun doesn't shine, it's night for sure. You're right. One rotation of the Earth is one day. After day comes night. And after night comes day again. The Earth spins like a top, and that's the reason why day and night occur. Quacky now fully understands. But Quacky is not a top. Quacky is dizzy. <laughs> Sleep tight, Quacky. When you wake up, it will be light. Lesson finished. Let's explore more knowledge about day and night.